When taking a look at a normal Ohio University men's golf practice, everything may appear to be normal, but it is anything but. Ohio University's men's golf program does not have a home course, and as you will see, it affects each of their golfers differently. It's difficult. I mean, we, we go play these big courses, and we're not used to it because we're used to playing these short ones that are a lot easier, so it gets a little, a little rough on the, on the road. It makes it tough because you don't have a, uh, a consistent idea of what it is to play in 18 holes, especially when you go into a tournament. Um, you have to uh, get used to playing the same nine holes over and over, which is a good and bad thing. Um, so come tournament time, it's a little frustrating because you don't get to get in that 18 hole mindset. But even without a home course, Bobcat golfers make it known that they don't think that should be used as an excuse. The facilities at OU are uh, perfectly fine. I think uh, it's a good scapegoat when we play bad to blame yeah. it on the facilities, but the facilities at Ohio University are great. I mean, like it affects it to a degree, but I mean, like we do have the opportunities here in the courses and the practice facilities to have it really not be that big of a deal, but it would be nice to have a home tournament. That would be special, but you can't always have what you want. The men's golf team now awaits the spring season as they finished up their fall schedule earlier this week with a third place finish in the Dayton Fall Invitational.